I'm Scott Abedijan, and I'm the CEO of the Rhode Island Public Transit Authority. We have 229 fixed route buses and 90 paratransit vans dealing with 36 of the 39 cities and towns of Rhode Island. I think all Rhode Islanders understand our need to combat climate change. Part of it was our first three Proterra buses that we brought on campus to be able to look at what are the pros and cons of electric buses, how do we maintain them, how do we serve them, um, what types of routes could they be used on, and so it also gives us an ability to have new buses for passengers that are better for the environment, that are quieter in neighborhoods, that don't add to the asthma rates and the problems that we see in many of our neighborhoods. So it's important that we diversify our fleet um, to not only meet the environmental issues, but to meet the health concerns and the um, other pressing issues that we have in neighborhoods. And we just received um, a $22 million raise grant from the federal government to allow us to electrify everything in Newport, Middletown, and Portsmouth. Electrification of our fleet is important environmentally, but the most important issue there is getting every Rhode Islander to come and check out one of our new electric buses, see what a good ride it will be, and hopefully become a regular rider on Ripley.